Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. This video is for all Android users who want to bypass Google account verification after reset. So, have you ever been in this situation or going through it right now? If yes, then you are lucky. In this video, I am going to share all the tips and tricks that will help you to bypass Google account verification after reset on Android. So, without wasting any further time, let's start the video. Before heading towards the solutions, make sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. First way, use Android Unlock Tool. When it comes to unlocking an Android phone, regardless of the type of screen lock, using the Android Unlock Tool is the best option. This tool is indeed the best way to bypass Google account verification after reset on Android. This tool can unlock all kinds of screen locks, such as PIN, Pattern, Fingerprint, FRP, etc. All you need to do is download this tool and leave the rest of the work on it. To download this tool, you can follow the link given in the description box below. Second way, bypassing FRP by using the Google Keyboard. You can bypass FRP on Android with Google Keyboard. To do this, on the verification screen, long hold the at key on the appeared keyboard. Then settings menu will open. Choose Google Keyboard settings and tap on the three dots appearing at the top right corner and click on the option Help and Feedback. Under the Help section, click on Using Google Keyboard option and long hold any key and tap on Web Search. Now type Settings in the search box and locate the option About Phone. After this, search for the build number and press it 7 times to enable the developer option. Now go back to the menu section and select the developer option. Select the OEM unlocking option and click on back two times. Lastly, reboot your device and connect to the internet. Third way, bypassing Google verification without internet access. Another method of bypassing Google account verification on Android is without internet access. To do so, insert a working SIM card into a locked phone and dial the number of that SIM from another phone. On locked phone answer the call and later save the contact by choosing add new contact. In the open contact form write any string of numbers, tap save and choose Google, further create a new account. Now, restart your device and your device will bypass the smartphone. So, that's all. I hope this video helped you to bypass Google account verification after reset on your Android phone. If you found this video useful, then don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends and make sure to subscribe to this channel to watch more videos. Thanks for watching.